Good evening, young professionals, families, community partners, and film aficionados to the 2021 High School of Art and Design Film Festival. This show is an opportunity to better understand the artistic vision, production, and design capability skills of one of the most talented groups of young individuals in this city, nay, in the country. And so, when you take a look at these films today, consider that this is the beginning, or middle, but mostly the beginning, of an incredible journey of filmmaking, storytelling, and creation that couldn't have been done without expert instruction and dedication to the craft. Enjoy. Hi, I'm a strategist at Netflix and I work on the product team. We create the images and the videos that promote our shows on service. We make those assets with diversity in mind so that we can reach the broadest range of members possible. I've been in the industry for a really long time and I'm so glad I landed at a place like Netflix because it's so completely committed to diverse storytelling. And as Netflix grows and we need more stories, we also need more voices represented in those stories. That's why it's so amazing that you're about to bust into the world and start telling your stories. The skills you've learned at film school are actually really incredible and they'll translate to a lot of different industries. You already have a huge head start on working collaboratively and giving and getting feedback and developing your own point of view. And you graduated during a pandemic, which is beyond impressive. So congrats on that and good luck in the future. Hello everybody and welcome to the 2021 Art and Design Film Festival. My name is Hanan Harkul. My name is Ashton Agbomenu. My name is Kevin Lopez. And we are the three film teachers at Art and Design. This has been an incredibly challenging year, but the kids really persevered. You are in for a treat. What you're about to see is our attempt at uh, showing you all of the fruits of their labor. Uh, we took all of the work that the A class has made and edited it down to a 90 minute film. Um, that doesn't mean that there weren't any other great films that should have deserved to be shown. Um, with that being said, you can head after the show to our Art and Design uh, Film Department Instagram page to check out some of the other work as well. We are so very proud of all of our students. We want to thank our parents for supporting the program and the wonderful work that was produced this year during super challenging times. But we're very, very happy to share with you an enormously beautiful body of work that I think you will all truly enjoy. We hope you enjoy the show. Grab your popcorn and let's have some fun. Let's rock and roll.
<laughs> Sir, are you still in that? It belongs in a museum. It is in a museum, the National Museum of Equilibria, where it can be fully appreciated by our people. What you're holding in your hands are the great remains of King Verkutu Pania. He's been one of our greatest kings. One of our museums! How much can I get for this? How dare you, sir? We at the Imperial Museum do not countenance the trade of stolen artifacts. Go see Quincy in the back room. He'll sort you out. Thanks. This just in America, this just in, we're having rapid developments in the identity of famous superhero 2020. Uh, got it. The identity of famous superhero 2020 is none other than billionaire playboy Alex Duane. I mean, dude, this stuff is on every other page. What am I supposed to do? It's, it's not that bad. You know, I mean, oh, one second. <laughs> Whoa. Sorry, traffic violation, but it, it's not that bad. All right, it keeps your identity on the down low anyway. Nah, man, screw that. Like, you know how long it took me to get my name to where it is today, just for some rich billionaire asshole to come over and- Sorry, what, what was that? You know you shouldn't drink that so fast. I'm smoothing your brain. And you believe that? Well, do you think they broadcast it for nothing? I'm asking you. Oh my god, it's 2020! Are they saying 2020? Oh my god! 2020! Oh my god! 2020! Oh my god! 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 You are not 2020. Did everyone hear that? Excuse me, but actually, 2020 is Alex Duane, as you can see in this paper right here. Who gives a shit what the news says? What has this guy done to actually prove that he's 2020? You think they put Willy Nelly on the news? No, they don't. Where did you... No, the world is not that interesting all the time. Since I got in the 2020 cosplay. Oh! <laughs> You guys want to put something on the air? Fine, all right? But how about I give you a fact for a change? My name is Mark Flint, and I am 2020. Uh, who are you? Just, just really ain't making good jokes. Jokes? 
This is about the truth. You want to talk about jokes? I've been working at Applebee's for 13 years while also saving your ass. It's funny because everyone just orders appetizers, right? And it's all frozen anyway. If it was frozen, why would I get my food hot? You warm it up. Can I go now? It's like I pay security for nothing. Hey guys, I just got a notification on my phone. So apparently if you stand next to stupid people, you get more stupid. And I already have an IQ of uh, a two. We should get out of here. You are 2012. I got rich things to do, so take care. Losers. Every goddamn time. Hey, it's J-A-D-E, you know who I be Going up in the Bronx, it's not always been easy Puerto Rican, Dominican, America, you know it These are my indices and I'm proud to show this Professional at the High School of Art and Design Working hard since 06, I keep on the grind I go to a and so I can go make movies You know I love the oldies, just like the goodies Documentaries, comics, and reality TV Are the movies I want to make one, two, and three. Here's a fun fact, I also love to play ball. I be breaking everyone's ankles, leaving them to crawl. The crowd goes wild as I shoot my shot. If you think I'm joking, I'm really not. Well, I hope you enjoyed because that's a wrap. My rap is pretty good, I guess you can say that I snapped. Okay, uh-huh, all right. Don't worry, it'll be safe with me, all right? This should be easy. Oh, all right, yeah, all right. Oh, so you coming to get it? Oh, yeah, it's right where I left. Like I said, it's right there. Uh, uh, yeah, all right, talk to you later.
They wouldn't believe me if I told you what I was doing. Hit me. Why don't you tell me about yourself first? Who are you? I'm an old friend. A modern day shepherd. So you must be a CEO of a company. That's the company that brings back loved ones. <laughs> a dating app? What is it? Tinder? Bumble? Hinge? You're such a joker. Now why don't you tell me what you're doing with that case? Soul. Let me get them back. Let me get myself back. Tell me who I am. And tell me who are you?
Leave me in fields of green Springtime rushing Under sullen skies And the stars will tease My uncultured eyes Knowing they can make up constellations And I wouldn't think twice But the moon is constant And she takes care of me Knowing her glow will always be Anything I want it to be She'll squeal as the sun slowly echoes through the sky And I'll question who I am when she no longer shines Cause it's springtime rushing Daylight's coming Lead me cause I'm blind no good at the act of patience Complacently I'm waiting To empty yourself like you did me No good at the act of hatred She's too good to me and I know it I know it Wait, this is precious to me. Whatever you do, guard it with your life.
Hi, my name is William Trevino. Oh, wait, that's not me. There I am. That's me. Born and raised in the Big Apple, I've lived in Queens for as long as I can remember. Unfortunately, I was also at the very center of the COVID crisis. This pandemic has taken from me my first year in high school, but has given me the rare chance to reflect on my own lifestyle. Not a lot of people get that opportunity. I started to exercise. That's how I got so buff. I haven't self-improved as much as I want to, but that's okay. COVID's not leaving anytime soon. I like to make art, and already wrote a published book, with two others waiting. One day I hope to write a story, maybe even a film, that many will see and many will be deeply moved by. Maybe I could even meet some of my idols. And although that seems like a long way away, looks can be deceiving. During the day, I'm a normal guy, but by night, I'm still a normal guy, just more awake than at any point in the daytime. Hello? A car? I don't even have a... Oh, stupid spam.
This isn't real, this isn't real, this isn't real. I'm here to help you fall asleep. You're not real and I don't need your help. Judging from the calendar behind you, you kind of do. No, I don't. You could at least hear me out. Please. It looks like you're not going anywhere anytime soon, so... Two hours of sweet, huh? Yeah. Well, that's why I'm here. How are you gonna do that? Talk to you about anything and everything. How are you supposed to do that? I think you'll find out. Okay. Have you ever watched Cloud Atlas before? Ask me why I like Cloud Atlas so much. Okay, why do you like that Cloud Atlas so much? Do you know when the characters died in one life? I like it when they find each other in another life. It makes me feel like you can have another life beyond this one that's better. See you later, Luann.
People want to be addicted. Phones are their escape, their day-to-day -day drug. They just accept it. Liking photos, making those stupid 10-second videos. We are not the problem. People are just dumber. You're going to get left behind. Facebook needs a new face. We need something substantially more addicting than Facebook. Instagram. <sighs> if I want to get people addicted, I have to catch them when they're young. Right now, it's just a site for lonely, middle-aged women. Facebook is all about bringing people together, making friends, socializing, being less alone, you know? Mr. Zuckerberg, I love the idea of bringing people together, but can you commit to not selling people's data? Maybe. Is that a yes? Is there anything you need to tell me? Your actions could have potentially destroyed everything that I've been working on. That we've been working for. Do you really want to go back to being a site for college students to get laid? Do you really want to go back to that? Mark! I can't wait to see you burn down to the ground and have Snapchat buy you for pennies. A million users isn't cool. You know what's cool? A billion gigabytes of stolen data. Why? To sell their data to China, of course. Don't you get it? How else are we supposed to make more money? What are your intentions with Facebook? World domination. I mean unification. You've been accused of invading people's privacy, tampering with elections, spreading false information, and selling personal data. How do you plead? As for the charges, I believe I deserve some recognition from this board. I'm sorry? Tinder, do you know how many people I got laid with that app? I don't understand. Which part? Birthday money. Snow money. Holiday money. Chore money. Grandma money. Invest in yourself. It's just so like, I'm tired of Paris Hilton. I'm tired of people who make me feel small, people who make me feel loud. I'm literally just a dog. Okay, like, okay, Michael Jackson didn't kill himself, whatever. But what can I do about that? Maybe I'm working because I got sick. I have a lot, I, I have a lot to think about that maybe humans can't understand. And I'm drinking water, I'm thinking in water, I'm thinking in numbers. You want to talk to me? <sighs> I love peanut butter and my mom. And eating why don't you? you every day every day i wake up and i get a kiss on my head and you don't and you're mad Oi! why do i what do i have to do to get respect out of you people it's like pulling teeth
I'm from Brooklyn And one day I want to make movies I want to create fiction and non-fiction films that will inspire people This is something that I love about our own design. We do not judge, we're very accepting, and you can be anyone you want, you can dress any way, and our community is very diverse, and we do support the LGBTQ community. I chose our design because of the atmosphere, the settings. I remember when I went to go visit the building, you know, it's very up to date. It has 12 floors, it has elevators, it has artwork everywhere. And in a way it was very exciting because you can tell that this school had a bunch of creativity. Transitions between classes, we do have school bells. And what I love about the school bells is that it's always different. So we have music, like I remember one day we had Lady Gaga, we have so we have opera, it, it ranges. It could be from country to pop. Since we do offer a lot of majors in our school, we get to familiarize different art forms. So in freshman year, you know, you did still lives, you did comics, you experienced every major in a way you kind of see what you like best. Our design has helped me by a lot with not only my confidence but my fashion style as well as like the opportunities that I've gotten from my time there. I believe I've had over six internships that the school has helped me with. I think every teacher that I've had I've bonded with. They're always there for you, you know, if you need help, extra help, you can stay after school. For lunchtime, you know, we 
try to make the best of it. You know, it is COVID friendly, so we do have our mask on at all times. We also um, do board games. Like I bring board games and, <laughs> and I just play with my friends. Our lunch time is around, I think like 45 minutes. So, you know, you do have a pretty good time. We are located on 56th Street between 2nd and 3rd. And if you have not gone around the area in the city, it is beautiful. So just a couple blocks down, there's Central Park. Food-wise, we have Chipotle, we have Dunkin' Donuts, McDonald's, Chick-fil-A, you know, the list goes on and on. I definitely do think that what I learned within the school has helped me and now I have like my certifications. If I definitely do need it in the future, you know, I have it. I knew that if I went here that it was going to help me with the outside world. And although it's very pressuring to choose a school, this one was definitely a welcoming one.
hell is that? Yeah, I'm searching the park right now. I'll tell you if there's anything here, okay? Okay, bye. Perfect.
Hey, ready to play? Yeah. Why it goes first, right? Yeah, but the board's not set up right. What are you doing? It's my turn. What? Fine. I win. That's not even how you play chess. That's how you play my chess. This ain't even fair.
Are you listening to me? Hello? Hello? Why won't you talk to me? I've been sitting here talking to you for the last two hours. Don't look at me with that face. Look, I even got you Skittles. You don't even appreciate me. You want some Skittles? Have some Skittles. You know what? You're right. I'm sorry for giving you this silent treatment. You know I love you, right? Romance the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Would you like some water? You can keep going.
I am not dumb. I'm not an animal. I am not unclean. I'm not a rag to your feet. I am not a slave. I'm not a threat. But because I'm black. But because I'm black. But because I'm black. But because I'm black. But because he was black, he is now dead.
little box is on the hillside. Little boxes made of ticky tacky little boxes on the hillside. Little boxes all the same. There's a green and a pink and a blue one and a yellow one and they're all made out of ticky tacky and they all look just the same. And the people in the houses all went to the university where they were put in boxes and they came out all the same. And there's doctors and lawyers and business executives and they're all What? 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 No! I want a steak! I want a goddamn steak! I, 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 if I had a steak, oh boy, a, a rare, a plastic, if I had a steak, I would fuck it. You don't like me cooking? Oh, don't be such an old bitch! You're drunk! You don't know what you're talking about! How could I possibly like the horse? You fix this up for supper. You're drunk! 
You ain't be saying that. Ten kitchen shanty cooks. You're you drunk. I don't. It's three times a day. You're drunk. I cut your hand bigger than your fist. You're drunk. I'm drunk. Uh, you I... heard me. I have been drunk since. Damn ye. Drunk since I first laid eyes on you. You're fond of me lobster, ain't ye? Drunker than a virginity fence. I seen it. You're fond of me lobster. Say it. Say it. Say it. I don't have to say nothing. Damn me! Let Neptune strike ye dead, Winslow. Hark! Hark! Triton! Hark! Bellow! Be it our father, the sea king, rise from the depths full foul in his fury. Black waves teeming with sudden foam to smother his young mouth with pungent slime. To choke ye, engorging your organs till ye turn blue and bloated with filth and pride and can scream no more. Only when he, crowned in couple cents, with slithering tentacle tail and steaming beard takes up his fell befitted arm. His call time Triton twitches bouncy like in the tempest and plunges right through your gullet, bursting ye a bulging blood and no more, but a blasted blooded film now and nothing for the harpies and the souls of dead sailors to peck and claw and feed upon only to be locked up and swallowed by the infinite waters of the dread emperor himself. Forgotten to any man, to any time. Forgotten to either God nor devil. Forgotten even to the sea. For any stuff for part of Winslow, even any scantling of your soul is Winslow no more, but is now itself the sea. destroy a stained glass window as an artist like yourself. However, since I can't have you following me either. How does it make you feel? Me and my brother were the best of friends. 
Nothing ever came between us. We were inseparable. Since we were toddlers, we looked out for each other. All I really want is for things to go back to the way they were. It never my intention to push him away. I would never do anything to hurt him. I loved him. I still love him. I love him more than my own life.
I can do. 